Unilever is a great company. This is a great business. We touch lives because we don't just give you products. Unilever is a good company to work for because they are always interested in our welfare. Unilever Ghana is Ghana's leading manufacturer of fast-moving consumer goods and is one of Ghana's leading corporate citizens with interests in trading, manufacturing, agriculture and real estate. In 1963, Unilever then established Lever Brothers, a consumer goods manufacturing business. By 1992, both companies had been merged and Unilever Ghana was born. We started divesting of the trading companies, which really isn't where our core competence is. Our expertise is in manufacturing of the fast-moving consumer goods. Unilever has now become a household name, and its products are used in over 90% of consumers' homes. We categorize them into home care, personal care, and then foods. What we want to do is to meet the everyday needs of consumers with um, products that will add value to their lives. And that is exactly what Unilever Ghana has done. Under home care, Unilever has brands like Key Soap, Omo and Sunlight. Personal care products include Pepsodent, Close Up, Geisha and Lux. And the foods category includes Blue Band, Royco and Frytol. Meton Key Soap, Sunlight, Lux, Brillant, Omo and maybe I will turn one. The <laughs> My dream was to build a marble pie pie. But also, I wanted to build a marble pie crew. My idea to make something important in the area. A major reason for Unilever's success is its distribution system. The company works with key distributors who target designated territories throughout Ghana, particularly the rural areas. Ninety-five percent of our turnover goes through the key distributors. That Brown Ventures, a key distributor, covers a large part of the western region, going as far as the border with La Côte d'Ivoire. It's a very big operation. Now we're covering uh, uh, the biggest part of western region. You know, we carry the goods, the doorstep of the customer, of the retailer. And so that is the advantage. One more product need to meet drum crossing crossing. The bia yeah the cover bia the re 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 crossing crossing the bia. That is despite the bad rules, despite rain or shine, we are there. In an effort to further improve its competitive edge, Unilever Ghana has embarked on a restructuring process and reduced its products from 17 to 13. It has also reduced its workforce that sort of positioned us for strong, profitable growth. In preparation for upcoming opportunities, new investment in the business is a priority. This year alone, uh, we're spending about another 50 billion in further capital expenditure, replacing some of our toilet soap lines, and roughly 45 billion on our investment in our brands. Modern factories are one thing, high-caliber employees is another. Much of Unilever's success is also due to its employees who are encouraged to share ideas and participate in regular training programs. Every idea is welcome. It doesn't matter whether you are a manager or a packer. They pick you, fresh or university, and they try to train you to become a, a very good manager. I mean, it's the only company that will say you don't have experience but come because I can make you become somebody. The job is really to raise the strategic IQ of each and every person. Training sessions are conducted either locally or overseas. Unilever International runs regional and international courses at its International Management Center. It's about adding value to your own life. So you come here one person, you're leaving and you are another person. And it's not just employees who benefit from Unilever Ghana. Its impact can be felt throughout the length and breadth of the country, extending to rural communities where it runs two thriving oil palm plantations in order to guarantee its manufacturing business a regular supply of raw material. It 
accounts for about 60% of our raw materials. And so we have, uh, we've, we've invested in securing a sustainable supply of our most important raw material. Unilever has built first-class schools on its plantations in Benso and Trifo. Bob Complex School is one of the best in the district. Everybody benefits, both parents and children, because uh, the children are getting educated and parents who are happy that their children are attending good school. We are preparing them for a better future. Some people develop, they go to school, they learn from us, and then if we need to employ contractors, we don't need to go to Accra or Takrade. The clinic at Benso, also financed by Unilever, has been designated as a national health service provider and caters for workers, farmers, and people from surrounding communities. We are not only treating the workers, we are treating all the communities outside. And sometimes they even invite me to a doom banso to go and attend to patients. Midnight, 1 a.m., 2 a.m., it's my duty. I'm very proud being a medical officer, and I'm also proud that I'm in the bush, serving the people. That is what the people need. And that is what Unilever Ghana is all about. Meeting the needs of the people, building and nurturing relationships, and being a catalyst for growth and development. We have every reason to be optimistic about the future because I will say that the company is positioned for strong and profitable growth. I see a very strong Unilever still delivering on its promise to touch lives, to bring vitality to lives. Meeting the needs of the consumer, satisfying those needs, and delighting the Ghanaian consumer.